how long does nicotine stay in your body when people use tobacco products some of the nicotine stays in their system after they quit smoking medical test can detect nicotine in people people's urine blood saliva hair and nails nicotine is the addictive substance in tobacco cigarettes and vapors or e-cigarettes when someone smokes a cigarette their body absorbs up to 90% of the nicotine traces of nicotine will linger long after individuals no longer feel the effects in this video we we'll look at how long it takes for the body to remove nicotine and whether it is possible to get nicotine out of your system faster how long does nicotine stay in the body 2 hours after ingesting nicotine the body will have removed around half of the nicotine this means that nicotine has a half life of around 2 hours this short half life means that the immediate effects of nicotine go away quickly so people soon feel like they need another dose when nicotine enters the body it is broken down into more than 20 different substances including cotinin anabasin and non nicotine people eventually excrete this by products in their urine doctors can use nicotine test to measure levels of nicotine and its by products in a person's urine blood saliva hair nails according to the american association for clinical chemistry it can take over 2 weeks for a person's blood to reach the same cotinin levels as someone who does not use tobacco it takes several more weeks for the urine levels to become very low traces of nicotine may stay in their hair for longer though people are rarely asked to do a hair test unless they are taking part in research the more someone smokes and the higher the frequency of smoking the longer nicotine takes to leave the body the exact length of time it takes for nicotine to clear differs between people nicotine may stay in the body for longer in adults aged over 65 years women tend to process nicotine more quickly than men especially if they are taking birth control pills the body will take longer to remove nicotine in people who have smoked more frequently and for longer how long does nicotine withdrawal last the severity and time scale of physical withdrawal symptoms will vary depending on how much an individual smokes a paper from 2010 suggests that people who smoke five or fewer cigarettes a day may not have intense physical symptoms because their bodies are less dependent on nicotine however they may still have emotional ties to smoking symptoms of nicotine withdrawal are at their worst a few days to a couple of weeks after smoking the first week is usually the most difficult and symptoms gradually reduce over the following few weeks the physical and psychological effects of nicotine withdrawal include anxiety or stress irritability trouble sleeping depression restlessness difficulty focusing increased appetite once the physical symptoms are gone and all nicotine has left a person's body they may still feel a psychological desire to smoke often this is often this is often because they are used to the habit of habit of smoking the desire for nicotine may be worse in triggering situations examples of this may include times of stress or when having drinks with 
friends over time this triggers become much less powerful smoking versus vaping nicotine test can also detect nicotine in the body when people have used an electronic cigarette or a vape vaping is a relatively recent invention and so little research has looked into its short and long term effects researchers do not yet know whether the body processes nicotine differently from cigarettes or vapes the current research has produced mixed results some studies say that vaping delivers less nicotine than cigarettes while others say that the levels of cotinin and nicotine might be higher in people who use vapes also it is difficult to tell how much nicotine people inhale from vaping this is because vape solutions contain different quantities of nicotine researchers are continuing to study the following factors that may determine how much nicotine people ingest when using a vape or e-cigarettes the amount of nicotine in the vaping solution the efficiency with which vaping devices deliver nicotine differences in how people use vaping devices including frequency and length of inhalation testing methods for nicotine testing of people for nicotine is sometimes done for insurance or job related reasons nicotine test measure a person's exposure to nicotine and if they have been exposed by how much this test look for traces of nicotine and other related substances such as cotinin cotinin is a more reliable measure of tobacco use because it stays in the body for much longer the half life of nicotine is 2 hours while the half life of cotinin is approximately 16 hours testing can use the following different parts of the body for tissue samples urine saliva blood hair nails can you clear nicotine from the body the best way to pass a nicotine test is to avoid nicotine for up to 10 days before the test as blood test can still detect cotinin for 10 days there is no sure way to flush the body for body of nicotine quickly but people may try maintaining a healthy lifestyle so that their body works efficiently the following methods may help clear nicotine from the body drink plenty of water to flush waste products from the kidneys and liver exercise to get the blood moving boost circulation and release waste products through sweat eat a healthful diet rich in antioxidants to help the body repair itself some commercial products and herbal remedies claim to speed up the body's ability to clear nicotine from the system but regulators have not usually tested them scientifically